Right, so good evening, everyone, and welcome to our Wednesday evening uh, India Market Opening Business Overview. My name is Bridget. I'm so happy to be with you this evening, calling you from Manchester in the UK. Uh, 14 years ago, uh, somebody came and spoke to me about this opportunity. I'd been an entrepreneur already for over two decades. And uh, even though in the beginning I was um, not clear on exactly how it worked, I knew immediately that this could be something for me and my family, which would totally change my life. And uh, my goodness, hasn't it done that and more. So this evening, I'm going to uh, first of all, pass over to our uh, my wonderful friend and business partner, Kathy, who is over on the other side of the pond in Texas. And she's going to walk us through the first part, uh, followed by our amazing, amazing uh, Dr. Polly, who's going to talk us a bit about the products. And then I will uh, end the presentation. So thank you again for being here. And uh, over to you, Kathy. Thank you. Thank you so much, Bridget, and thank you for inviting me to present tonight, today, this afternoon, <laughs> whatever it is. <laughs> whatever. Yeah, get, this, this clock change doing my head in, really. Yeah. So, <laughs> You're um, yes. So, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. My name is Kathy Smith, and I live in Houston, Texas, but I originally came from the United Kingdom. I was introduced to this business about eight years ago, and I quickly realized that there was a lucrative business. But for me, the most important thing was actually be able to make an impact on people and also find my purpose. You know, I've been a stay at home mom since 1984. And basically a trailing spouse over, you know, um, with my husband living in three continents. And so this business actually did give me that purpose. What was I what, what did I been put on earth for? Right? My mother always said, you will find your purpose. So here I am, and thank you again, Bridget. So the India Market Opening Business Overview. So um, I've been partnered with this global wellness and anti-aging company, as I say, for about eight years, and our company generates nearly $3 billion in annual revenue. And in 2025, they are opening for business with India. What that means is we're going to be creating a massive opportunity for people to generate a substantial revenue, but also to create a lot of money for India, which is very, very important to remember. OK, so, so many reasons to take a look at this business. Some people want extra income. Some have always wanted to own their own business. Others come for the community or travel opportunities. And the biggest surprise for me was the personal development. So as a company, we have invested well over $500 million in technology since the beginning of 2021. And that's really important when we look at our mega trends. We are firmly invested in the mega trends, for example, Internet of Things and artificial, artificial intelligence, with which we are aligned perfectly. Now, why that is important is because you want to ensure that you are able to build your business from anywhere in the world and I know that Bridget has ladies and gentlemen working with her for like over 19 countries. I have ladies working for me in nine countries. So we want you to be to ensure that you're able to not only build your own business, but be able to have the apps and technology to do that. We also want to ensure our customers are receiving an incredible customer service. As we know, social commerce is a growing trend, as is the gig economy. And the beauty and wellness industry is over $3 trillion, and we are positioned perfectly for all of them. So let me introduce you to our company, Newskin Enterprises, who celebrated 40 years of success and currently trade in nearly 50 markets. And I was able to be at the big birthday party, actually, in July, when we did celebrate that 40 years anniversary. One of the things we pride ourselves on as a company is our expertise when it comes to market expansion strategies. We have been anticipating the potential of the India market for many years, but we had to ensure that we were carefully prepared for its entry. That time is now, and it is a testament to our growth and stability. We are publicly traded on the New York Stock Exchange under the ticker NUS with an A plus rating. I love that. That means we are totally transparent. Whatever Bridget, myself, and Dr. Polly tell you is absolutely the, what we have to say. Otherwise, we are really smacked very hard by FTC regulations. 
So this means that you'll be able to do your own research into our financial credibility. I want to mention that we also have 75 in-house scientists, each with different disciplines. Most companies only have two or three. And also our scientists have collaborations with another 150 experts around the globe to ensure that they are providing high quality products for us to take to the market. My favorite story is seeing all the pictures on the wall at the corporate office of about 30 ladies and gentlemen. And upon asking one of the scientists, who are these people? The response was, this is our board of scientists from other facilities, for example, universities who are putting their names to our science and products for a nominal fee. Such is the power, credibility, and validity of our company. So now I'm gonna hand over to the amazing Dr. Polly, who I'm lucky enough to have working with me on a daily basis. Dr. Polly, take it away. Thank you, Kathy. And it's a pleasure to be a part of the team. Uh, we have a very successful holistic healthcare clinic here uh, just north of Houston, Texas. And it has been our absolute pleasure to bring in the new skin Pharmanex products and they have made such a difference to the health and well-being of our clients. So I would like to tell you about our innovative products and technologies that really do offer solutions within the marketplace. And what I will say is when we launch in India, we already have this platform of products for you, which are readily available for you to start to leverage and introduce to your network in India. When we do launch into India, you will have all of the knowledge of these products. And also, we will be tailoring some of these products specifically for the Indian market. We will be manufacturing them locally, meaning that we will be obviously creating more jobs within India. At the moment, our open market really focuses on the innovation of wellness and beauty devices. And this is an area where we have excelled for many years. For the last six years, we have been the number one in the world for at-home beauty device systems. Now, these devices also have consumables with them, which makes this a really lucrative opportunity. Our whole product range encompasses wellness and anti-aging products, many of them designed for social selling. You can look to build your business both online and offline. Now, the idea of the business is that you start to use the products yourself you market them to your network, and then you introduce this opportunity to your network also. Over to you, Bridget. Thank you so much, Polly. So I'm just gonna wrap up this uh, presentation, talk to you a little bit about our sales performance plan. Uh, when, as I said, I was introduced to this 14 years ago, uh, my first reaction when I started to uh, discover the, uh, the the technologies and products was just, wow, this is incredible. I just actually started to work as a styling consultant and I added a beauty and technology line um, to offer that alongside my styling business. And uh, the results already on the people that I was recommending it to were fantastic. So that was a very, very easy thing for me to do. What I didn't understand was this part that I'm going to tell you about now, the sales performance plan. I'd never run a business like this before in my life, but... When I saw these numbers that I'm going to show you now, I suddenly realized that this is what I've been looking for all of my life, an opportunity to build a business around the world without having to scale my costs in an unlimited way and to be non-location dependent and something that I could build around my family as a single mother and sole provider. So if you like, we have three sections to our sales performance plan. First of all, on the left here, you can see the word share and underneath it, brand affiliate. So everybody starts at this level, you become a brand affiliate, it's a completely free account, and here you will be able to make a retail profit of up to 38% and an additional sharing bonus for any time that somebody buys a product from you using one of our sharing links. This is more like a casual business. It's something that um, you can do on and off. You can do it consistently just for a few hours a week or a month or whatever it might be. There's no targets and there's no obligatory purchase. Of course, it's always useful to try a couple of the products just to make sure that you're happy to recommend them. 
The next part, the build section that you can say it, see in the middle, is where you become what we call a brand representative. Now, this is where you have a little bit more structure to the business. This is where you will be able to have what I like to call an online store or like a, a, an online micro franchise, where you will have your own clients. You will be able to also introduce other affiliates who will also have their clients. And here you will unlock a bonus called a building bonus, which can be up to 40% on the combined revenue of all the products that are consumed in that e-store. So here you can see you're really, really making an opportunity to make more money. And of course, you still get paid your retail markup and your sharing bonuses on your personal sales. So the lead and the partner and director program was what really interested me that you can see on the right hand side. What I understood this was, was that I would have my own online store, but I would also be able to help other people have theirs as well. So imagine now, if you will, across the world, a network of online micro stores or online e-stores and on each of those e-stores that of people that I have helped and in turn they have helped other people I make between five and fifteen percent commission okay so this was really what was interesting to me because of course I wanted to do this for myself but I also really wanted to be able to help other people to do the same as well and that's what happened uh, over the course of time for the next few years. So to make this a little bit more concrete, I just want to show you this particular slide here. It is our official sales performance plan slide. Uh, as Kathy mentioned, this is a publicly traded company. So all these facts and figures are in the public domain. And I've highlighted three numbers, which are, as a general rule, the ones that are interested, most people are interested in. You can see here at the brand representative level, the average income is around about $500 a month, about £450. That's not counting retail uh, profit and bonuses. This is just in pure commissions on your building bonus sales. So that would be the equivalent of what, I don't know, a small car loan, or um, you, know, you could save that up over the course of a year and go on an amazing holiday, something like that. A lot of people do that around what they currently do, around their families, um, they can do it in a way that suits them. The next level that people are often interested in is Ruby Partner. So a Ruby Partner is somebody who has become a brand representative and helped four other people to do the same. The average income for that person is around about $2,500 a month, or if you like, about 2,000 British pounds. So if you think about the baseline salary in the UK, which is around about 24,000 pounds a year, this is an opportunity to double that baseline salary. Most people will still be part-time when they become a Ruby partner. And that is an enormous quantum leap in terms of an increase in income. And so this was really the first pin title that I wanted to shoot for, which was Ruby partner. It took me a grand total of 110 days to become a Ruby partner. So it doesn't take that long. And uh, yes, I was committed to the the the, uh, the process, um, but I did have my styling business still at the same time and, uh, and my family. So I did it part time and uh, this is it. So everything is possible. But what really interested me was I, uh, the part which was Blue Diamond Director. There you can see on the far right of the screen. The Blue Diamond Director average income is just shy of $24,000 a month. So around and about £20,000. I really wanted to know what I needed to do to become a Blue Diamond director, because that is life-changing money, was life-changing money for me. And so I had the the privilege and the pleasure to be able to work with mentors and guides who were able to guide me step by step to become a Blue Diamond director. And this is one of the things that I didn't have as an individual in my uh, in my previous businesses and my bricks and mortar businesses, because I didn't have anybody to help me that I could call when I wanted to, or that would always be there to, to give me a hand for free, <laughs> uh, because a lot of business owners have business coaches, but they're extremely expensive. But this is the highest level of coaching that I could have wished for, for free to help me become successful. And I think that's one of the great things that people don't always see in this business in the beginning, but I'm telling you, it's amazing. So what is a first mover's advantage? A first mover's advantage is for people who are business minded, who understand what it means to go into a new market. And this is the opportunity that we have here going into India. There will never be another time like this and there will never be another uh, uh, opening of a market like India. So if you're here on this call tonight, I really want you to congratulate yourselves that you're here because you are one, some of the rare people who understand this incredible opportunity that we have before us. So just to finish, if here's a few of the numbers. India is now the largest population in the world. I think they kind of vie with China, but let's call them the largest for the moment. You know, probably a couple of million either way. 
But what's really interesting is the growing middle class who are the vast majority of the population in India, all of which are social media users. I, I say, It says most here, but I would say all of them are. And uh, I had a conversation with a lady this afternoon, just as an anecdotal story. And she said, she said, they're not just got one phone. Everybody has two phones. And I was like, wow, I did not know that. She said, everybody in India has two phones. So, so you've got this massive, massive, massive demographic, 950 million people under the age of 35 who are all using social media <clears throat> and at least have one phone. And for the most part, if I understand, have two. Now, that is an interesting demographic for us to be able to work with. Not only that, we use a business model called direct selling. The direct selling uh, business uh, uh, revenue in India at the moment is around about $3 billion. So actually, in the grand scheme of things, that's not much. But it has a compound annual growth rate of over 13%. And that is huge compared to the rest of the world, which is somewhere between 3 and 4%. So you can see here, there's the, all this alignment of different things that are making this very, very special at this point in time. Now, here's the thing. You might like to write this down. The first year the company predicts we're going to do a billion dollars in revenue. They have put in place a leader's founder's bonus of 2%, which is $20 million aside for people who have the largest sales teams built before we open India at the end of next year. The only question you need to ask yourself is how much of that leaders founders bonus do I want for myself and my family? Because everything here is possible. So let's just draw a couple of comparisons here to see, you know, how does India draw up alongside countries like Japan and South Korea? Well, Japan has a population of 125 million, so roughly about 10 percent of India. They have more than 300 people in Japan who have earned more than a million dollars with new skin, okay? So COE, circle of excellence, million dollars plus plus. In South Korea, they have a much smaller population, about 51 million, and they have 5,000 sales leaders, leaders. And the potential with India, as I said, a billion dollars in revenue with 30,000 sales leaders. So again, this is something that, as Forbes says, the best time to join a company is when they're in the midst of a global expansion or a new product launch. But let me tell you, we're not just in the midst of a global expansion, we are constantly launching new products as well. So you have this incredible alignment of all these components, which make for this something very special indeed. All right, so how are we gonna maximize this opportunity? Well, we need to act now. A lot of people are saying to me, well, how do I work in India? And what do we do in India? For the moment, nothing. We are focused entirely on the markets that we currently trade in, particularly the US and the UK because there is a very large population of people here who are from India, but also are based in the UK and the US. Not only it could be Canada, it could be South Africa, it could be anywhere in Europe, but the people that we want to particularly speak to are the people who are of Indian origin and that they live in one of our open markets. So I'm just gonna go through this very briefly about if you're interested to earn more than 500 to 1,000 pounds dollars, euros a month with this company. We call this the Partner Pre-Launch Roadmap. Just as a reminder, again, I've highlighted all those numbers in yellow that are relevant to this, uh, this presentation. Now, you'll see here, as I said, the $512 going right through to the 24,000, just about. So there might be somewhere in the middle that you're much more interested in, but this is the level that we're talking with now. Become It's very, very easy to get started. Today, you can create uh, an account to become a brand affiliate with a link that the person who invited you here will send you. It takes five minutes to set up. Very, very simple. Name, address, email, telephone number, and that's pretty much it. Your next stage, you're going to download two apps, one called Stella and one called Vera. The Vera app is for our customers and the Stella app is your back office where you have everything you need to track your business and create purchasing links. With the Vera app, you'll be able to do a skin consultation, or we like to call it a skin and lifestyle consultation, as well as a selfie, which will scan 3,000 points of data on your face. And then you will have an AI-generated skincare protocol, hyper-personalized just for you, so you could choose the products that you want to try that are going to be perfect to have a fresh, healthy, glowing, and radiant skin. That's how simple it is, and it only takes a few minutes. So it's no wonder the company has spent over half a billion dollars developing this technology. So then you just order your toolbox. Uh, we recommend for the partner program that you have all the four uh, major technologies that we use because they're our best sellers, um, but at least two of them, because you're going to be able to try them yourself and also to demonstrate them. All right. Now, 
this is where people often get confused because they want to, they want, they immediately think that they're going to be able to, you know, do it this way or that way. Well, the good news is you don't have to have any guesswork because we have a system. It's called System 7. We have a working system. So you know what to do every single day that the time you have available for your business, what you're going to be doing to build your business it's called System 7. As I said, you set your money goal of what you'd like to earn in terms of income. We help you write a contact strategy, not just a list, but a real strategy according to the level of participation that you want. And then we will give you all the tools, the resources and the training to know how to invite somebody to a presentation how to follow them up, how to onboard somebody and how to connect everybody with team. We have it all in resources, completely free of charge. Talked about the free mentoring earlier, but we also have all these online resources as well. And we also do in-person events, which are incredibly good fun and really powerful as well. So just a little recap on specificities of somebody who is of Indian origin. This will be somebody who is born in India, but works in one of our open markets, particularly UK or USA. This is called an overseas citizen of India or somebody of Indian origin who was born in either UK or America, but their parent or grandparent was born in India. They qualify to be able to go and work directly into the Indian market because as British or American people, we do not qualify. We have to work in collaboration with people who do qualify. And these are the profiles that we're looking for. So just to be more specific, uh, this is just an example. It's an, an inexhaustive list of the type of people we're looking for. High potential business minded people, a um, little bit maybe like myself, you know, I'd had a 20 years business background when I came in, um, where it was, I understood the genius of the business model and uh, how I could build this for myself and my family. We're also looking for people who want to monetize their social media, particularly Instagram, which is really probably the most commercially viable platform that we have right now. Um, these don't have to have a huge following. Um, we have people, everybody started at zero. <laughs> and uh, we have people that started with maybe, you know, 100 or 250 followers, and now they're at 2 million, right? So so we have a system of how to develop on uh, social media, how to share purchasing links, how to share products, and so on and so forth. And uh, this is where you really literally have a business in the palm of your hand. And it's so much fun to do. The third category, uh, an example, is for beauty and fitness professionals, healthcare providers who are looking to expand their customer base outside of their salons, clinics and spas. OK, so this is some, uh, you know, because those kind of businesses are very location dependent. And of course, if they don't work, they don't get paid. And so what we're doing is offering a possibility for them to expand their income, which is not dependent on their actual business itself in terms of where it is situated, situated uh, geographically. All right. So there's a little overview of who we are, what we do and how we do it. Uh, we repeat this presentation every Monday at 2 p.m. UK time. I'll let you figure out where you are in the world to be able to see what time that suits you. And every Wednesday at 8 p.m. as this evening. And uh, I hope this has been useful and we look so forward to seeing you next time. And when you come next time, please bring a friend, introduce people, uh, because the more the merrier. And we love bringing this presentation to everybody. Thank you so much and have a great evening, everyone. Good night. Thank you, Bridget. Bye, Sandra. Thank you.